In my clinical work, I witnessed people transform their lives through the use of meditation and changing their sort of conscious state. Not everyone can have a near-death experience that might help you transform your idea of, of life and meaning and love. Not everyone remembers being uh, a, another human being, having a past life memory. So for those of us who haven't had the honor of those experiences, I wanted to study how can we make that manifest? What can you do to access that knowledge? The research I do at DOPS really helps inform my clinical work so I can help patients get better and take it out of the clinic and potentially use it you know, across the board. My research explores the impact of altered states of consciousness. These altered states of consciousness can be achieved in a variety of ways. I study how meditation impacts people's consciousness and the impact it has on things like their mood or their anxiety. I work with people who are facing death um, in the cancer center, people with a diagnosis of cancer. And what I've discovered is if we can alter their consciousness into a meditative state, many of them can lose this fear of death and approach the end of their life with much more comfort and peace and have what we would call a good death. And I've seen the impact of people discovering a different way of thinking about their consciousness, a different way of thinking about their personality and seeing it as something that could extend beyond their body. And it is transformational in their mood, in their functioning, in the way they treat others and this earth. It's so positive. At the Division of Perceptual Studies, we see that breakthroughs really come from people who challenge the current paradigm. And that's certainly what we're doing at DOPS.